Another big story we're following tonight. You can keep ordering those drinks to go. Governor Hogan signed a bill making takeout cocktails and that alcohol delivery a more permanent convenience now. So this was supposed to be a temporary thing, granted only during COVID lockdowns to help local restaurants and bars, but now it will be allowed for at least the next two years. Hey, WJZ live at 11 o'clock tonight. Kelsey Kushner has more details on all of this. And Kelsey, I imagine this is welcome news for a lot of people, especially business owners. Sure is. Well, bars and restaurants may be back open, but not everybody feels comfortable venturing out just yet. And of course, that's okay because restaurants will still be able to sell these to go cocktails so people can, of course, enjoy, enjoy them at home. And many restaurant owners that we spoke with today say they hope this is a recipe for success. If you can't get a seat at the bar at Cindy Lou's Fish House in Baltimore City, you can take your cocktails to go. I definitely think that's going to be a huge help for us. Thursday, Governor Hogan signed a bill that will continue to allow restaurants and bars to sell to go cocktails until June of 2023. With the pandemic shaking up the restaurant industry, manager Jimmy Jefferson says to go booze will continue to be a big boost. We wanted to keep as much of our staff still on board as possible. So to be able to still employ bartenders because we're not just boxing up food and sending it out of the door was a huge deal for us. During the pandemic, restaurants took a major hit. At Dry 85 in Annapolis, General Manager Grace Canfield says to go cocktails helps them stay afloat. In the beginning, it was very much something that we needed to do, but at this point, it feels more like something we get to do. As restrictions are lifted across the state, Canfield says to go cocktails will give those who might not feel comfortable heading out the perfect reason to stay in. The idea of somebody being able to get a full dry 85 experience from the comfort of their own home is very exciting. Now, Maryland is one of 35 states that are allowing to go cocktails as a COVID relief measure. Reporting live tonight, Kelsey Kushner for WJZ.